The Beijing Winter Games opened on Friday night in a snow and ice themed ceremony at the Bird's Nest Stadium that concluded with the cauldron lit by two young Chinese Olympians, one of them a member of China's Uyghur minority. During a performance that went longer than scheduled on a frigid night in the Chinese capital, President Xi Jinping declared the opening of an Olympics whose preparations were beset by the pandemic and criticism over human rights in China. Dinagir Yilamujiang, a 20-year-old cross-country skier born in Altay in the western Xinjiang region, lit the cauldron along with Zhao Jiwen, 21, who competes in Nordic Combine, finishing a torch relay whose final runners were Chinese Olympians from recent decades. The identity of the final cauldron lighter is traditionally kept secret until the last moment, and Dinagir's inclusion was noteworthy since China's treatment of its Uyghur Muslim minority, which Washington deems genocide, was the trigger for a diplomatic boycott by several Western countries including the United States. The identity of the final cauldron lighter is traditionally kept secret until the last moment, and Dinagir's inclusion was noteworthy since China's treatment of its Uyghur Muslim minority, which Washington deems genocide, was the trigger for a diplomatic boycott by several Western countries including the United States. Friday's ceremony in a partially filled Bird's Nest Stadium, the scene of Beijing's triumphant 2008 Summer Games launch, was filled with imagery of ice and snow, with Xi's declaration followed by red-suited skaters sliding across virtual ice. They were accompanied by a version of the John Lennon song, Imagine, which has become a fixture at Olympic ceremonies. Held on the first day of spring by the Chinese calendar, the ceremony began with a performance by dancers waving glowing green stalks to convey the vitality of the season, followed by an explosion of white and green fireworks that spelled the word, spring. On a three-dimensional cube resembling a block of ice, lasers carved figures from each of the previous 23 Winter Games. The block was then, broken, by ice hockey players, enabling the Olympic rings to emerge, all in white. 